okay, okay, now blink. Okay, I'm aware of that. Okay, but I've always wondered, and I'm probably gonna sound stupid, about the whole one eight one eight two thing. Uh, there was an Irish band named uh, Blink that sent us a cease and desist letter and told us that if we didn't change our name, then they would sue us. So we just put a number on the end. The number has no meaning. We just we make up stories about it, of course, but it really doesn't mean anything. Oh, really? Yeah. So it's just a one eight two, just to be a one eight two. That's right. Yeah. Well, actually, for a long time, I was really. Uh, terribly overweight. I was just kind of let myself go and we were drinking beer out on tour every night and uh, I tried dieting and it wouldn't work whatever and I went to a doctor and for my uh, build and my height my ideal weight was 182 and this was happening right around the time we had to change the name so around my house I had 182 on little post-it notes on my mirror on my refrigerator to help me out on my what? And uh, Kind of contribute and then they don't contribute yeah. So, uh, so that's what the 182 is. It's just, do you want it messy or do you want it straight? Uh, whatever you think. You've been down there for a while. You're not even focusing. You're just looking now. I'm trying to find it. <laughs> now, are you familiar with what the concept of this video is? The concept? Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, it's just basically following the lines of the song, which is, you know, you break up the girl and you end up seeing her everywhere you go. And, you know, every time you see her, it like, breaks your heart all over again. And, My name's Scott! Uh, the concept of this video is um, we have figured out a way to clone dinosaurs okay. by getting DNA from bugs that lived thousands of years ago and were uh, frozen in amber. We have this little island and uh, we clone the dinosaurs using the DNA, like I said, and uh, the dinosaurs go crazy. Sounds like that's been done. I, mean, I, don't, I know you're just about to shoot the video. I hate to tell you that. Someone already does that? <laughs> Someone already did that? Yeah, you didn't know about that? Is it that <laughs> Spielberg? <laughs> God. And action, Blake! So big. I was in bed last night with my woman. This is what happened. We have a fun time. It's the weakest spit. <laughs> oh, they did it to this girl. She's all upset. Whoa. How's it going? Pretty good. And what are you doing here? <laughs> I'm uh loading up the ads. Really? <laughs> you know what doesn't you know what never made any sense to me at all? Tell me. Is the big battle scene at Inhoff with the ad ads. Luke Skywalker, just fresh out of his destroyed snow speeder. Right. Takes his little grappling hook. Well, thing. which first of all, which when everyone else gets hit, they go down or they blow up instantly. They blow up, he got hit he got actually hit twice. Twice. Just does a right. nice landing in the snow. Runs around, takes his little grappling hook, shoots it up to the bottom of the ad at, gets pulled up about seven floors right. to the top. About seventy feet he falls. Yeah. He takes his lightsaber. It's a, it's the ad at's completely impervious to laser fire from these snow speeders, but he just takes his lightsaber. Well one hit opens I'll, the I'll give you the, the lightsaber because that's probably got a little force juice in it. Yeah. So. Just one hit, throws in the grenade, cuts the cord, falls 70 feet, lands on his feet, and runs away. No, he so, lands on his stomach, but then he gets up. Well, I mean, you know, yeah. just runs away, no problem. That never made any sense to me. Why didn't he break his legs or, you know, have major internal injuries? Well, see, the only, the only, you can, you can kind of justify anything that Luke does, just the force. Yeah. And I'm also not sure what everybody has against C-3PO, that in every movie he gets taken apart in some way. Every movie, yeah, yeah. Star Wars, yeah. the same people rip off his arm, right. Empire, the, uh, the whole thing, the whole, the whole thing. kit and caboodle. And then in uh, Jedi, the uh, 
Sebastian B. Crow eats out his eye. Yeah. Every single movie, he just gets jacked.